Hi YouTube. Uh, this video is about the importance of exercise. And uh, my, um, this was before my doctor realised that I was so low on iron. He suggested that I do um, one hour of hard physical exercise per day. Um, and I did try and do that. Um, for a while and um, I did a session at the swimming pool and I checked the clock you know how they have a big clock on the wall so right I'm gonna swim hard for an hour <laughs> which I almost managed I obviously did pause for for kind of stops um, every so often and then my knees started hurting and I had to change to back back crawl or whatever you call it I don't know much about swimming but I do love being in the water um, and um, I was still having um, feelings of um, withdrawal symptoms from coming off the lithium and I, I wasn't steady or stable but I, you know I love the water and for me that was kind of a bit therapeutic as well as exercise um, and um, the other day I wanted to go on my bike for a cycle ride because when I lived in England I, um, I actually cycle to work and back every day so I do at least an hour five times a week of cycling and I used to go pretty fast and sometimes I'd have my daughter on the back um, she's she got pretty heavy after a while so that was good exercise and since moving here I haven't really done hardly any cycling just because we live in the country and um, it's a bit far really to get anywhere on the bike um, so you have to do it on purpose um, for kind of a leisure activity rather than going A to B which is what I used to do you know home to work or going shopping or whatever um, and, um, yeah, so then, uh, then I had severe anemia and, you know, I could barely walk, let alone do an hour of physical exercise. Um, but now that I'm starting to improve, um, like this morning, um, ooh, got a call coming in. Hang on a second. Um, I, I noticed this morning that my lips are starting to be a bit um, more pinky red and I had more rosy cheeks, which I haven't had. I've been much more pale. Um, so that's a good sign. <laughs> and um, so today uh, my exercise was going for a walk and I went from my house around this big loop uh, around Mont Gaillard and back again. It took me an hour. Um, most of it was actually pretty slow because it's been raining so much and I had to dodge all the muddy puddles and everything. Um, I should have put my wellies on but I didn't. <laughs> um, but it was still good to stretch it out and I was like, oh Robin, do you mind if I go on my own? Because I wanted to go at my own pace um, and he was cool with that so um, he did his own thing. And uh, yeah, so I'm basically going to pick that up again and and get more endorphins going with with more exercise um, as the days go on and find different ways of bringing that in to my life. Um, I was sorting out the back back room as we call it, um, that bit of that building there <laughs> where we still have all our boxes from where we moved country. Um, I saw the tennis rackets and I was like, oh, I'd love to play tennis. I love tennis. Um, I haven't yet found a court near here that we can use easily, but um, Maybe in the summer we'll do that again. And I think um, the thing to do is just pick um, a kind of exercise that you really enjoy and um, that you love doing. Uh, don't pick something that's a chore for you and you're like, oh, I hate running, I'm not going to run, you know, I don't want to run, but I'll do it anyway. Don't force yourself, choose something that you really like doing. Um, sometimes I even take my shoes off when I go for a walk and um, get the benefits of grounding and connecting my soles and my feet to the earth which I've been doing a lot today and it feels really nice and I can't believe it's the beginning of January and you know I've got a vest on a top and a scarf that's it and I'm actually feeling almost too hot <laughs> I love this part of the world isn't it amazing <laughs> so yeah do physical exercise, especially if, if you're feeling mentally unwell and get those endorphins pumping and um, just kind of do whatever you can to improve your, your mental health and 
and to those feelings of happiness. I hope that's a bit of help to you and I'll see you again soon. Bye.